Hello guys, welcome back to Sports Corner GH. My name is Adam. So guys, finally, the international break is all over. The Black Stars had the opportunity to play two international friendly matches in the month of October. One against Mexico and also one against USA. We lost both games. But in today's video, I'm going to tell you an update concerning the Black Star players. Most of them are departing from the Black Star camp to their club side. We are going to talk about it. And I'm also going to give you some injured updates concerning Black Star players, which includes Mohamed Sanisu. Majid Ashimeru, Daniel Amate, Alexander Jiku, and also Daniel Kofi Chire. It's been a while we have talked about this place, and I'm going to give you their updates. Life is first for GJ. So if you have not subscribed yet, please make sure to subscribe. If you have already subscribed, to thank you very much, and may God richly bless you. On the Black Star series, we give shout out because you are still doing the Black Star series. We still give shout out. So guys, if your name is on the shout out list, I want to say a very big thank you to you, and may God continue to bless you. But if your name is not here, don't worry, comment under this video and I'll make sure to bring up your name in the next shout out in this we do live here on Sports Corner GH. Also, don't forget, in the month of October, our giveaway is still ongoing. Comment under this video and any other video we drop you on Sports Corner GH. Be part of the top two commenters and earn yourself a free JC of your choice. Very, very simple. Please make sure to participate. So guys, quickly, let's jump into it and talk about the latest concerning the Black Stars. Now, the Black Stars in October were you know fortunate to play two international friendly matches high profile ones one against mexico and also one against usa you and mexico ghana ended in a 2-0 win for mexico and usa ghana ended in a 4-0 win for usa so ghana lost both international friendly matches we played in october and also we considered six goals without even scoring one or even replying all the six goals that were scored against us i mean that is done we move on to the next games the Black Stars are going to play in November, which is the World Cup 2026 qualifiers. One against Madagascar and also one against Comoros. These are big matches. Looking at our performance, these are big matches to us. And most of the players that were called up this month might not be called up next month. So we hope to see and some some you know some faces return to the Black Star squad. But per what I know and what I've heard, most of the players are departing to their club side. By the close of today, most of them will arrive at their club side and train with the rest of the team because most of them have games to play over the weekend on Friday, on Saturday, on Sunday, even on Monday. So some of the players are quickly, you know, leaving the Black Star camp and going back to their club side and train with the rest of the team and also make sure they are abreast with what the plan is going into the weekend. So most of their players are just moving and moving and moving and moving. So guys, this is the latest update concerning the Black Star players. Now, I'm going to talk about these five players that it looks as if we have seen them in the world, in the Black Star squad. And I mean, I mean, we have not talked about them in a while. So because of injuries, these players have been you know, sidelined from the Black Stars for some time. But I have some good news concerning these players and I'm going to talk about it. And I'm going to begin with Majid Ashimiru. Now, Majid Ashimiru was out, out out because of injury and he was out for three months he was out for three months and it was a hamstring injury hamstring injury but just 14th october when black stars were collecting with two with two with two with two majid ashimiru made a return he's now playing back for underlet on the 14th of october he came in the second half in a game for underlet so this shows that um, majid ashimiru is fit he's back he's playing football and this is good news in my own opinion we hope that Majid Ashimiru slots back into the blasters and give us some creativity we need in the midfield. Now, moving away from Majid Ashimiru, let's talk about Mohamed Salishu. Now, from what I hear, Mohamed Salishu under, underwent, underwent a brain surgery. And from what I hear, he has started training small, small. Or training small, small air, but small, small. He will recover very soon. But what I hear, he will recover very soon and he will be introduced in game bit by bit. Per Monaco, they don't want this injury to reoccur again. So they are taking their time with Mohamed Salisu, who is yet to make his debut for Monaco after signing from Southampton. And he's one player that a lot of Ghanaians, even including myself, can't wait so that he will be much fit to represent Ghana. If not in November, at least at the Afghan tournament in January at Ivory Coast, we need Mohamed Salisu for our centre back. Now, moving away from Mohamed Salisu, let's talk about Daniel. Kofi Chire. Now, Daniel Kofi Chire 
has been out for injury for a very long time. It was it was a knee injury, and up to now, um, the latest we have on Daniel Kofichu is that he normally visits Barcelona training center to undergo rehabilitation for his injury. And the last time he spoke, he says that he is progressing day by day. This is what Daniel Kofichu said the last time. You know, he was interviewed about his injury. But what I hear, he will be returning very soon. Daniel Kofichre would be returning very soon. And this is good news in my opinion because he has been sidelined for a very long time. And we hope that he will come as soon as possible, be much fit, and also get his come back to be able to slot into the Blaster squad. So guys, this is the latest concerning Daniel Kofichre. And I'm going to talk about two other players who were originally part of Coach Chris Uta's final 23 mile squad to play in the international friendlies. But they excused themselves because of some injuries that we don't know about but i'm just going to talk about them the first player i'm going to talk about is daniel amati now daniel amati was part of coach shooting's finals with the three minutes part to play mexico and usc but for some reasons he excused himself and the next day or the next two days we saw daniel amati training with bexita's team now people were speculating that he wasn't injured then he drew and uh, he redrained himself because he didn't want to get injured or lose his position at bexita's uh, whether this is very true or not, I can't tell. But the communique that came from Ghana Football Association was that he was injured. But if he's already training with Bexitas, then I believe there was a minor injury that they didn't want to become severe. So they were just taking care of their own player. And I believe he's going to feature for Bexitas in their next game. I believe Daniel Amati's injury is not a severe one because he's already training. I've seen videos and pictures of him training with the Bexeter squad even when he left the Black Stars team. And also, Alexander Juku, same thing. Yeah, Alexander Juku, too, same thing. Um, after he excused himself for the Black Stars squad, I believe that um, it was, it's not a major injury, it's a minor injury. He's also going to feature for his club side because he's also training. We have seen pictures of him training. So most guys are speculating that they don't want to get injured. So guys, this is the latest update concerning Black Star players who are injured and it's been a while we have heard from them. Mohamed Salisu, Daniel Kofitra, Majid Ashimiru, Daniel Amate and also Alexander Jiku. Now what we hear is that South Vigo are seeking to, you know, perform another test, a further test for, you know, Joseph Edu's injury. But what we hear, that injury is a very serious one. It looks as if it was simple this but it's a very serious injury to his ankle and south avigo are you know trying to look at the injury and make sure that they operate on him very quickly in fact immediately so that is that's the latest update concerning the black stars let me know your thoughts about it down below in the comment section don't forget to like subscribe and turn on notification to sports called ig my name is adam i'll make sure to see you in the next video Charlie, we go back